Hello everybody, how are we doing today? Edgar Allen here from Allen & Bradley Leather here in New York and today I want to show you um, I want to show you two wallets. Actually I want to show you the wallet that I carry which is my minimalist wallet and I also want to show you a regular wallet and I'm going to explain to you what happens to guys wallets most of the time. You see how thick this thing is? This is a regular wallet that probably was purchased in a um, in a retail store and uh, what happens is that this wallet is a bifold wallet it says here genuine leather but obviously we all know it's not genuine leather um, but here is what happens when you get yourself a wallet and you start putting things in your wallet you put cards credit cards money receives business cards a whole bunch of different things here so this wallet start becoming bigger and bigger and bigger or should I just say fatter and fatter and fatter as you can see here uh, this thing is huge now this thing rests rest in your hip bone all the time because you're sitting in constantly your wallet I mean there's no way you can actually put this in your front pocket so it has to go in your back pocket uh, and it's just growing and getting absolutely out of control uh, and I think what happens to guys' wallets is that the more junk you put in, uh, we don't clean our wallets, not even once a year, so you just keep on going on and on and on and on. And it keeps filling in with all kinds of things. Now, this wallet is less than a year old. This wallet is probably almost two years old. And this is Simplify, Simplify Wallet. As you can see here, I have everything I need here. And look at the difference between these two wallets. You see here, I want you to look at the difference between those two wallets. This one is huge, it's like a brick. It feels like you're carrying a brick in your backpack. This one is very light, easy to carry. You can put it in your backpack, uh, in your back pocket or your front pocket, even in your shirt pocket too. So this one is very easy, very lightweight. But I look at this thing, it's turning into a monstrosity because it just goes on and on and on and 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 you know what guys w you know look and this is without even putting anything in these pockets here you know we have more pockets that have not been utilized here too you have one one more packet over here that is not being used actually two more all right you have a you have even you have something with the zipper here so it's just absolutely out of proportion i don't know I, I see a lot of guys carrying this type of wallet and to me it's just like wow how can you how can you actually walk around with something like this this is so big so huge and it just keeps on getting bigger and and again uh, this is not even real leather now whenever you buy a wallet in a uh, you know uh, not from a reputable vendor like ourselves but a wallet that you buy at the store for $29.95 or $19.95 whatever the price is uh, it says genuine leather and genuine leather is usually the third layer of leather uh, is not even top leather because the very first best leather is the full grain leather that's the one you want to buy this is full grain leather this one here uh, this one will last you a lifetime this one it has uh, this one is the uh, genuine leather which is has a life of just a few months to be honest with you you know the life you know the lifetime of this leather is just a few months and then other than that it just becomes this a brick in your back packet all right so uh, you know and it's totally falling apart it looks like it's 10 years old but in fact it's not in fact it's not even a year old all right folks so uh, you know look at this compare look at this too all right folks thank you very much appreciate talk to you soon thank you for giving us the opportunity don't forget to buy made in america thank you bye